Hey everyone, this is Bales. I'm at Fantasy Labs looking at PGA player models, and I wanted to do a video showing you how you can um, look at past results. So I think that um, this is maybe a hidden feature of the site that not a lot of people know about, but a really valuable one if you can use it properly just to test some things that you're doing. So um, we're looking at the current tournament for PGA. Um, up here is the a calendar that you can use. Um, you can actually use it to look forward in the future uh, as well, um, particularly in nightly sports like uh, basketball and baseball to um, just start your research for the following day. We might not have all of the data, depending on if Vegas lines are out, but you can start that early. But you can also look back into the past. So we can click um, a date a couple weeks ago and you will see your model for a particular tournament um, but you also see a new column here which is actual points so there's four places that you can see the actual points scored by um, every player that was in a particular tournament for golf or whoever it is um, so we have this column here and you can just sort of match up those actual points with your model you can also see actual points in the optimizer so when you click optimize um, this particular lineup would have scored 302 points. Um, the third place is in multi lineup, so um, you can play with this and actually um, uh, generate lineups and um, change parameters, change exposure, um, also change your model. Um, so uh, you can see the actual points that were scored right here. Um, and it looks like the optimizer would have beat all but three of these um, 10 lineups. Um, but <clears throat> if you play around with your model, you can start to get a sense of what type of model would have worked in that particular tournament. And so I, I suggest using that, um, going back and, and just um, messing around and seeing what would have worked uh, with trends for particular courses for golf or for particular matchups in another sport to get a sense of, of what's working. Final place you can see actual points is in the My Lineups page. So we're looking at current right here, no points in, uh, but if you go to a past date you can see the actual points that your lineup scored. So these were My Lineups and um, you can see the, the points that they scored in this particular tournament. So uh, I definitely recommend using that um, and uh, I think not a lot of users are clicking on um, that calendar to go back and really look at past results, but it's a really good way to um, judge the effect effectiveness of your model um, and your ratings over the long run.